How are you? Yes, I am fine, man. Thank you for asking. What about you? I am also doing great. Thanks for asking. Okay, so we are meeting first time. Let's start yes. our introduction. Yes, sir. my name is Sunil. I belong to Haryana recently. I live in Bahadur city. I have done MBA in finance. Uh, I have two kids. My elder daughter studied in fifth standard. My younger daughter studied in third standard. And I have my own YouTube channel uh, related to health. Uh, related to health because I am I am a gym owner right now and I am running my gym. Yes, I am very health conscious person. I always do exercise in morning and evening time. So that's all about me. That's amazing. Really nice. Okay, it's my turn right now. I'm Preeti and I'm an English teacher. I'm working in a private school. Simultaneously, I'm work, uh, running my two YouTube channels. One is Easy Way to Learn with Preeti. That is my study channel. And another one is Easy Way Vlog. That is my vlogging channel. And I'm also from Haryana. So, same state. We are. So, that's all about me. Which city, ma'am, do you belong? Uh, right now, I'm also living in Bahadurgarh, but yes, my uh, maternal city is Gurugram. Gurugram, okay. Bahadur, I am also from Bahadurgarh, ma'am. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, hard. Okay. So, are you a YouTuber too? Mm, yes, I have uh, two YouTube channels. One is related to English, but now nowadays, I am not uploading any video on my uh, English uh, YouTube channel. Just only I am uploading. And my another channel is related to health. Okay, that's good. So, uh, why you are not consistent on your English channel? Like, uh, I don't have much your time, ma'am. I don't have much more time because I have to maintain so many things at my home. So that's why I'm not able to manage both of channels. So just only on my health club channels only i make some short video and that's only 25 seconds and 35 seconds related to that's only i upload i'm not getting much more time to upload long video so that's why in these days i'm not uploading any video on my english channel okay okay, okay. that's nice like uh, you are already running your another channel huh? mm, yes okay okay so, is there any purpose uh, regarding your English channel? Why you started another channel? Like, you are a gym trainer and already you have another channel that is related to health. So, why you feel the need of English channel? My, my first channel is English channel. Okay, okay. So, I'm starting you, sir. I started this channel uh, one year ago. That time... I was not able to speak much more, so then I thought that, yes, at any cost, I have to learn this language. Then I thought, I at any cost, I have to learn this language, then I started to teach some students at my home. Those are living nearby my house, and mostly students, they are studying in uh, Hindi medium school. Some students are studying in English medium school, but in English medium school, there are not any English environment. So mm -hmm. that's why I... Uh, I talked uh, with them and I said that, yes, do, do you want to learn this language? Then they said that, yes, uh, we want. And then I said that, yes, you can come at my home. And I taught all the students three of course at my home. And I practiced with them. I make some video with them and I have already uploaded on my YouTube channel also. So by doing this, I learned so many things from my students, some new vocabulary, and I know that time I was, uh, I knew all the tense. So, but my mostly students at my home, they don't know the tense rule. Even a single student, they don't know. My, I want to tell you that in 12th standard student, they don't know the tense rule. And after 7 to 18 days, they told me that they know very well the, all the tense rule. Now, mm -hmm. my elder daughter, Study in only six standard, and ma'am, she know very well all the tense rule, and she is able to speak little bit to someone uh, other person also. She talk with me in English also. I practice with my daughter also type, and I always say and uh, say my daughter, yes, you have to speak in English. Try to speak in English because in future it is very important to speak in English. Without English, it is not able to get a good job 
in our India because in our India, it's a mentality of every person. If you know how to speak in English, so in this case, you can get a good job. Hmm, definitely. Uh, and I can understand this. It is a mentality of not only in India. I think in other countries also. Like if you are a good English speaker, only in that uh, case they will treat you very uh, like they welcome you if you are a good speaker. And definitely yes, no. English is very beneficial. That is the need of today's life. If you are a good speaker of English, only in that situation you can uh, oh you can crack any type of interview. You can go abroad. You can face. I think you can easily face every difficulties. in our career life right so uh, yes you differentiate about the students like a uh, uh, 12 pass out student is uh, was not able to speak english they were not finalized about tenses and even your six six uh, standard that is or uh, is in six uh, she is six year old no she is standard now she is 10 okay. year old okay uh, like you are telling about your uh, daughter she is in 600 and she knows each and every rules of tenses and she is a good english speaker right so i think uh, in a classroom our uh, the mentality level the mind level is uh, you know iq level that is totally different of every student uh, and uh, when we put pressure on a student like you have to speak english in that situation they never understand the value of english whenever they realize like without english we can't go ahead in the life we can't crack any interview if we, any person is uh, want to go abroad for higher study and in that situation if he or she is feeling the need of english only then they try to uh, learn english rules and they try like uh, now i have to focus on uh, the need of english like i have to speak english right now so i think totally depend dependent on the need like when we feel the necessity of english in that situation we'll try to speak out english most of person which i observed like uh, they are they have good knowledge of english i have done conversation with uh, so many persons and uh, most of them are good uh, they have good knowledge of english they have good qualifications even though they are not able to speak so what is the reason behind that i think they uh, they do not do practice that is the main yes. reason na which we observe only, english is only a language like uh, oh. you can see that when a child take a birth that time he and she don't know what is the rules of our native language just only mm-hmm. one or oh, two years and three years just only he observe what we are saying like okay. grandparents father mother they are speaking little bit words and only this only he observe and after sometimes he started to speak so mm-hmm. nobody tell that these are rules of our native language just mm-hmm. only same here english is only a language but we are not yeah. speaking we are not trying to speak because in our environment you can see that our neighborhood if i talk about my at my home there is no english environment that's only i talk with my father mother it is only my haryani language and uh, hindi language with my daughter also if mm-hmm. i try to speak someone else in english little bit daily half an hour so automatically after two days a uh, few month i uh, i will be able to speak in english but i am not saying that uh, yes you can get a uh, much more fluency in a short period but yes if you have con- consistency if you are doing practice daily if you are speaking half an hour one hour daily in these days i am not practicing ma'am just uh, if i talk about 6 uh, months ago that time i opened my gym near about uh, at 10 marks after okay. that uh, i am not getting much more time but before this i practiced daily near about 8 hours 10 hours i watched one movies english movies and related to some sentence video i like the channel kanchan ma'am channel ha 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 kanchan ma'am and i study so many sentences also i learned and i practice with my daughter also i gave and my daughter know more than 
500 students, uh, 500 sentences very well. So by doing this, I learned so many things and I, I practiced a lot. But nowadays I'm not getting much more time. Whenever I get free time, so I try to talk with someone else. It's my okay. hobby to speak in English. And I always tell my daughter, you have to get common on this language. Because huh. when I was doing so, and I was, that time I was facing interview, it, uh, it was too much difficult for me, ma'am, because I was rejected so many times just because of my communication skills that time. Then I mm -hmm. thought, yes, in future, my daughter will not face this type of problem. So I have to start English environment at my home a little bit. So I'm trying. Exactly. Yeah. Sometimes like a person who is going outside for the future, for the career. So definitely we feel, uh, I also rejected in started time. And when I started my teaching career, that time uh, it is not in the craze like to speak English. I think this craze and the need of necessity of English came after Corona, the pandemic. Uh, because after Corona, most of persons, uh, it is compulsory for each and every student to take online study and uh, do most of work online. So that is the uh, online, uh, you know, that is the need and uh, like everywhere that is compulsory to speak English to English. In that situation, we feel like English is important right now. So definitely, I, which I observed in myself and uh, most of students, they always consider and they always feel the necessity of anything uh, only in that situation when, we, uh, when they are facing, like uh, without English, we can't go ahead, we can't do anything. So in that situation, they try to do like right now, I have to work on my English because English is just a, a mode of communication. So, OK, apart from the necessity and this uh, overall uh, the description about the essential about the necessity of English right now, I just want to focus on our con uh, conversation topic and today's discussion topic, which I uh, found for ourselves, that is surprises. Do you like surprises? Hmm, surprises. Yes, I'm every person likes surprises. If a surprise is good for a man okay. and woman, so it is uh, every person like. Hmm, definitely. You know, surprises can be uh, both. Like, uh, uh, when what is the difference between surprise and shock? Shock and surprise. According to me, both are same. If we think like surprise, if you uh, suppose uh, you want to go anywhere uh, you say it's your dream you, uh, you want to go any hill station and you you don't have uh, permit you don't have permission to go there and you are asking your father mother and like you are a friend and they are not uh, allowing you you and you don't need to go there any hill mm -hmm. station so that time i think and uh, you think that in your mind and you sit on your bed, what should I do if uh, I can agree my father, uh, mother and parents and uh, like my husband, how can I go to a hill station? So in this case, after uh, one day, two days, suddenly your husband and your father and mother say that, okay, now uh, they, uh, they, they, uh, they are giving a ticket to you and that time they are saying that look at this and what when you see the ticket and you are uh, you find that oh this is a <laughs> ticket of hill station so it's a surprise and it's a shocking for you to be that time so according to mm -hmm. me both are same but it depends on situation sometimes uh, like a person uh, not uh, not thinking anything not thinking uh, something uh, like you want to achieve this type of things and suddenly I suppose uh, uh, just only you are thinking in your mind uh, like uh, your uh, you uh, your uh, parents are leaving other uh, city and you want to meet and you are thinking just only you are sitting on your room and you are thinking just uh, any chance uh, uh, in afternoon time, suppose you are sleeping and you in your dream, you find that your parents come at your home and they want to meet. You are that time you feel happy when you 
see your parents at your home and after that uh, when you woke up uh, wake up and you see that oh there is no <laughs> no one here and mm-hmm. suddenly you go and you wash your face and suddenly someone is ringing a bell at your door and then you then when you go to open the door and you see that you you find your parents at your home so that time it is shocking for you mm. yeah definitely like uh, surprise and shocking can be same or can be different that depend on the situation Especially, like that yes. can be accidentally or incidentally both like mm. if something is good for you that is you can say that is good surprise and that if someone is hurting to you maybe right now you know there is a craze of prank so that is also like a surprise <laughs> okay so uh, have you remembered any day like have you forgotten any special any important day in your life yes ma'am so many things i found in my life because when i was doing job so that time that's only i was thinking that yes at any cost i have to purchase my own car at my own uh, money because that time i am not thinking that yes i i want i need a single penny and i take some even a single penny from my parents also so that's mm-hmm. only i was thinking when i get a job and i at any cost i have to purchase my car and when i get a job in gurgaon mm-hmm. in something company that time i was doing work in sunbeam company it's uh, it is located in gurgaon and after two months i i bought my new car that time so it was uh, i think uh, good for me and it's a it's a biggest dream you can say that for me yes i have achieved my first dream to bought uh, to buy uh, my new car okay okay and you forgotten uh, you uh, that day no no ma'am uh actually my question was that have you ever forgotten any important day in your life any important day like your birthday your anniversary maybe your daughter's birthday like this has yes, a, uh, it happened with you yes yeah, sometimes my i i forget forget my daughter's birthday and that time <laughs> my daughter start to fight with me <laughs> and mm-hmm. they say that they say that yes how can you forget my birthday papa <laughs> so you have to give me some uh, big, biggest amount for this because you forget my birthday and i will purchase something so and at any cost you have to uh, you have to give money for this so then i said okay it's my mistake i forget your birthday and i will give you the money whatever you want i will provide you Mm, definitely it happens like if you are feeling stress or maybe you are busy in your schedule in your job so sometimes it happens like uh, it happened with me also like i forgot many times my own birthday <laughs> so yes, okay my, what do you think that time my birthday i forget ma'am uh, but my friends they know uh, mm. uh, the date mm. uh, my birthday because that time they were only thinking about the party yeah definitely it happens with everyone like uh, there are social media on uh, social media account <laughs> that is the uh, yes, you yes. know uh, uh, yes everyone can easily find out on which birthday yeah on which date we have to, uh, to get the party so definitely our friends always wait for that day okay what you said that any time like uh, nobody remembered your special day like uh, your family members and your friend circle it it, it happens with you hmm in uh, my in my home mostly my father and mother yes my mother know very well my birthday date every year my mother know but uh, my father never think about this because hmm. they, they are uh, all it's only you can say they belong to a uh, village type peoples and they don't like the type of things much more my mother also but yes my mother all every year she knows what is the date and when my birthday comes so she uh, my mother always tell my daughter also as your father birthday is coming 
So my and my daughter okay. always ready to get some party. At that time, I go outside and we celebrate a little bit. Yeah, definitely, and that is really nice uh, feeling. Like when your family members, especially mother, when your mother eagerly waits for your day, your special day. So that is really nice. Like uh, we are already grown up, and even though if our mother or father waits for that special day, so that is really nice uh, feeling for us. Like they are uh, because you know we are the children. and uh, we always be a child for our mother and father whether yes, we are about 30 40 15 which age we are but they always treat us like uh, our small child so that is really nice uh, feeling for us okay do you have any questions hmm yes ma'am uh, i want to ask you you are nowadays you are focusing on this language and you are thinking that yes this language is very important so what type of way do you use to improve your communication skill what type of content are you using to improve and how much time are you giving to learn this language can you tell me <laughs> frankly speaking i am not giving much time to, uh, to learn this language i just uh, you know whenever i get time because right now there are vacations in every school so i am also enjoying my vacations in my home and uh, i have visited uh, two three places also so in this june month i have done conversation only two three conversation i did till now so i am okay. not yeah i am not focusing more uh, on regular basis but yes uh, i kept my one book reading book and uh, on every day on regular basis i am uh, just uh, making this habit of reading like uh, every day four five pages i read in that book and uh, that is written by chetan bhagat but yes uh, whenever school will reopen again like in july so uh, i do practice i do conversation with my student so in that case i am really uh, i think i am in the regular practice with my student so i i am not focusing on uh, regular basis more and more time but yes i do conversation only one or two in a day good ma'am you told me that you are a teacher which subject do you teach ma'am yeah i am an english teacher english so definitely that is uh, yes that is important for me uh, like to speak english to english with my students okay ma'am you are teaching in school so in your school there is a english environment they talk with teacher and yes yes i think right now everywhere in every state english environment is compulsory and uh, it is important to speak english for a teacher whether you are a which subject teacher i think only hindi teacher can speak hindi hmm yes ma'am you are saying like i think in bahadurgarh city just only in few school i found that uh, they there is a english environment they allowed to speak in english like uh, bal bharti school and rama bharti school no, no. i think in every school in most of schools there is english environment thank you very much okay. i am good night okay have a nice day too